in the world of web development there are numerous technology stacks available for developers to choose from however mern stack is the most widely used stack in developing rich modern and seo friendly web applications this is because mern stack provides greater flexibility and customization developers can choose the tools and packages they want to use and customize them according to their needs and this flexibility makes it easier to create more scalable and complex applications and thus the community of mern stack is growing at a very high pace also due to react js which is a key component of the mern stack it has gained a lot of popularity in recent years and is widely used in modern web development therefore i recommend mern stack to all the beginners who want to master web development as fast as possible so basically the mern stack is a powerful combination of mongodb express react and node js mern stack developers are in very high demand due to the increasing need for web applications and due to the popularity of mern stack among different different companies it has gained significant traction in recent years according to glassdoor the average salary of a mern stack developer in the united states is around $100000 per year now that you got the basic idea about mern stack and why you need to learn it let's get started with the complete and step by step mern stack developer road map So before diving into Mern Stack, you need to have a strong foundation in the basics of web development. This includes HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. HTML is used for creating the structure of web pages. CSS is used for styling, and JavaScript is used for adding interactivity and functionality in the website. Now you don't need to master HTML, CSS, and JavaScript fully. Instead, just learn the basics of them and move forward. And trust me, guys, this is the best way. to learn web development faster here is a list of basic concepts to learn in html which includes semantic tags tables and unordered lists for css here is the list of the key concepts to understand which includes knowing the flexbox layout and understanding the box model and for javascript you should learn the basics of the language including variables data types functions loops and control statements plus you should focus on es6 features which includes array destructuring object destructuring rest operator spread operator array methods such as map filter and reduce as they would help you a lot in react Now once you have learned the fundamentals I highly recommend that you should learn some of the CSS frameworks like you can learn Tailwind and Bootstrap however I love Tailwind CSS and I use Tailwind in most of my projects you can also use CSS preprocessors like SAS that will give you some extra power to your ordinary CSS and manage your CSS a lot With SAS you can use variables and functions to group your CSS code that will of course help you increase efficiency and productivity. Now similar to Tailwind and Bootstrap that are CSS frameworks and that are used to make your CSS easier JavaScript also has some frameworks that make JavaScript easier to use and hence React is one of them which is one of the most popular JavaScript framework that is used to create modern single page web applications Single page means that they do not have the weird loading spinner at every click a react app only holds single html file and it allows developers to build interactive and dynamic user interfaces using reusable components to become a pro mern stack developer you should learn react and some of its important concepts including jsx components props state and hooks to get started with react you can create a simple project and use the create react app using vue to build and run your project you can also learn next js which is a complete react framework that uses react and that is also considered as the future of web development which includes modern web development concepts such as server side rendering and static site generation so learn how to create components how to use props to pass data between components and manage state using modern react specific tools and packages such as redux with redux you can manage your entire react application state and can create complex front end applications very easily 
Node.js is a JavaScript runtime that can help developers to run JavaScript on the server side or in the backend. This is used to create RESTful APIs very easily. The basic thing about Node.js is that it uses JavaScript and as you already know JavaScript, hence you can learn Node.js in a very short amount of time. And hence Mern stack is the fastest way to learn web development these days. You should learn how to create a server in Node.js, how to create an API and how to connect Node.js to your React frontend. Now once you learn the basics of Node.js, you can learn Express.js which is the most popular backend framework of Node.js and it makes writing Node.js very easy. So finally to complete the full stack web development process, you should learn a database and Mern stack uses MongoDB, hence it is a very popular NoSQL database that you can use to store data. So you need to learn how to connect Node.js application to database and store the data, how to perform the CRUD operation which is acronym for create, read, update and delete. Now with these steps you can create a dynamic, responsive, full stack web application that is ready to be deployed and used. And at the end I want to include a bonus tip and that is once you complete learning all the concepts of Mern stack, be sure to create as many projects as you can. Specially create an e-commerce app with authentication, shop and payment integration, a blog and a social media app as this will make you the master of Mern stack. So guys that's it, I hope you enjoyed this video. At last I want to mention that if you want to see why you need to switch to Tailwind CSS as soon as possible watch this video